Welcome back to DT Daily, I'm Caleb Dennison. Coming up, Amazon wages a big war with a little stick, Elon Musk's secret tech fear, and some scientists build a Death Star. Well, maybe just a little Death Star. Amazon is the latest company to go after total living room domination with the introduction of its Fire TV stick, the newest HDMI dongle set to battle Google's Chromecast and a similar device from Roku. Like its competition, the Fire TV stick is a device about the size of a pack of gum, which you simply plug into the HDMI port of your TV in order to stream a wide variety of content. So, what makes it different from its competitors? Well, it's rocking a dual core processor, 8 gigs of storage, an optional voice control remote, and of course, access to Amazon's vast content reserves. And if you're not a Prime customer, you also get a Prime upgrade for a month in the deal to feed your TV addiction. It's only 39 bucks unless you are already a Prime member, in which case it's just 19 bucks. But that price ends today, which makes it a pretty easy call in our opinion. For all his smarts, huge fortune, and amazing engineering prowess, there's one area of technology that scares modern tycoon Elon Musk, AI, or artificial intelligence. At a recent MIT symposium, an attendee asked Musk what he thought of AI. His response? He said creating AI would be on par with, quote, summoning a demon. And he called the primary archetype of the technology, the murderous HAL 9000 from 2001 A Space Odyssey, a puppy compared to the real dangers AI might represent to humanity. AI gone bad, is it ever good, has been a staple of science fiction for decades. But real efforts to create it are underway, including those by Google and numerous research institutes. It's also at the heart of the next Avengers movie. So is Musk right? What do you think about artificial intelligence? Go ahead and leave us a comment below. Another area where science fiction is becoming science fact is laser weaponry. Right now, actual combat lasers are huge affairs that have to be carried on battleships or housed in buildings. But that may be about to change. Researchers in Poland recently released a grainy video that shows them creating a laser pulse, or bullet, packing an enormous 10 terawatts of power. So how did they aim it down a hallway? Easy, the device that generates the pulse can sit on a desk. Each laser bullet is about three feet long and the device can fire 10 of those per second. While the video makes it look like it's going slowly, don't be fooled. The laser blasts are moving at the speed of light. It's just a special kind of photography that makes it look slowed down. And you know it must be stormtroopers pulling the trigger because they're not coming anywhere near hitting that guy sitting in a chair. And that's DT Daily for today. We'll see you tomorrow.